Hello lovely people, how are you today? Welcome to my Q&A in which I will A your cues. What's your morning routine? Well, the first thing I do in the morning is brush my teeth and sharpen my tongue. Dorothy Parker, comma, H-B-I-C. Do a John Green impression. Oh, I'm going to have to get into character for this one. Okay, guys. Okay. I'm not racist. I have one black character in one of my novels. I read Toni Morrison. And I am fully qualified and educated enough to speak about transgender rights because I once met Laverne Cox. My brother's record company signs only white people. In fact, it has signed more rapists than it has signed people of colour. Who was your top pick for each season of RuPaul's Drag Race? Yes, All Stars included. My favourite queen in the entire history of RuPaul's Drag Race is Tammy Brown from season one, second to be eliminated, unjustly, unjustly. Like, you get Tammy Brown to do a Destiny's Child challenge? That's not what Tammy's about. Hey, Perry, if you could give advice to a new booktuber, what would it be? Um, how do I say this? Run. Favourite golden girl and why? Honestly? I could vomit just looking at you. <laughs> if you could smack any author in the face, who would you smack and why? Do you know who I'd fucking smack? Do you know who I'd fucking kick into the middle of next week? Kazuo Ishiguru. Why? Because he fucking wrote The Remains of the Day, which is, oh my god, so good. It's really, you have to read it if you haven't. But then all the rest of his novels, they're kind of shit. They are just... In fact, I actually, I think I have film. I have actual footage, real footage, of what would happen if I ever met Kazuo Shiguro. Do not stop it! yelled at a girl like this. When my mother yells at this, it's because she loves me. I was rooting for you. We were all rooting for you. How dare you learn something from this? When you go to bed at night, you lay there and you take responsibility for yourself because nobody's going to take responsibility for you. Films or books that have made you cry. Actually, recently I watched a film that made me cry like a baby. I watched Stuck in Love. It was so fucking awful that it actually gave me glaucoma in both eyes and thus rendered my tear ducts invalid and the waterworks. I was I was blind for three days. Which YouTubers did you used to love but now hate? Um y yeah all of them. What genre of music do you listen to? Well, personally, I exclusively listen to dubstep remixes of Enya songs because they're the only things that can actually produce raw emotion within my husk of a body. <laughs> would you recommend to a non-reader? Well, I thought about this one for a while, and I'm just gonna have to recommend one of my favourite books of all time, and that is Birth Control is Sinful in the Christian Marriages and also Robbing God of Priesthood Children by Miss Elizabeth Yane Strong Anderson. I do hope that I answered all of your questions sufficiently. Sadly, I have to stop the video there because I have a meeting in my local church. We're trying to fundraise to reanimate the corpses of the victims of John Wayne Gacy. 
actually, you can actually help us out on Twitter by tweeting with the hashtag We are a small church group who are trying to fundraise to reanimate the corpses of the victims of John Wayne Gacy. All of the help is needed, guys. Please and thank you. God bless.